Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, happy birthday, happy birthday to you. Hey Chris, that happy 21st birthday. Um, I know this may seem kind of belated, but um, um, it really isn't it? Because originally I was gonna record it this the, the, your this birthday video of yours um this afternoon, but because I slept in so late, I, I and then all of a sudden the Spurs game got my way on Fox Sports Southwest, and then I talked to my friend Jackie and her friend Aaron um before the game started, and so yeah, I just got through watching. It was a crazy finish. Spurs won one away on a five with the Celtics. It was not a pretty win, but I'll take it. So here I am making your birthday video. Like I promise, it's better late than never. I don't care if it's past midnight and it's if it's technically not the fit, not your birthday no more. But here it is. This is your birthday song I wrote for you. I kind of wrote, wrote it last minute. I was I, I had no time to do it for like a regular song by an actual artist because um, it would have taken more work than I than, than um than I and then the song I actually wrote. It's, it's a song from a video game. Like, I'm not gonna tell you what it is until I start to sing it. Until I play it and then sing it. Um, this is this is what I'm gonna play for you. The PS2 is already on. Crash Nitro Kart for the PlayStation 2. I'll give you a closer look at it. I did this game for a Let's Play per the request of one of my subscribers and fans, who is also my Facebook friend. Um, but now it's a, I'm doing it as a birthday special special for you. Um, there's a bunch of there's a bunch of games out there that um uh, 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 I mean there's, I I don't think there's hard uh, hardly any game that I have not done for a birthday special or a Let's Play on my YouTube channel yet. Um, but uh, there's some I'm gonna do. Uh, there's some in, in here that we um uh, in here where I keep my Wheel of Fortune and Jeopardy uh, video games. Some I'm gonna do for a, a birthday specials this month. I'm just not gonna tell you who because I don't want the people who I'm on, I'm doing it them for to find out. Um, so yeah, I mean, I already know. I'll let's um I'll show you what game I'm actually doing for a Let's Play sometime at the end of the, at the end of the month. Prob uh, possibly on the. Well, the 29th, I'm doing a birthday special, I believe. If I'm correct me, if I'm not mistaken, um, and then maybe, and I think the 30th, uh, the 30th, I'll do my final let's play, which will be on this game, which will be on this game. That's a game I already did that for a birthday special for my friend in NASCAR, Miss Cora's Light Amanda Merge, her her 29th birthday, November 21st. But that'll be my last let's play of 2015 on the December 30th. I forgot to say that my Thursday night presentation video. Even though this is a birthday special for you, but anyway, that, um, so uh, before I get into the song, I'm gonna say a few things. First off, I'm glad you have a Facebook now. I kind of, I kind of wasn't expecting it when, um, when you uh, first created it. When I saw that um, uh, you had one, I thought, ooh, I remember her. She, I used to go to school with her. We were, I first, I was in Berea with her, and then I was in Polaris when I was, when I had to finish two full years of ESL. Um, well, you were already assigned to be there anyway for the regular two years in the one one program the whole time. The reason why I was still I I was still there with you and a few other Berea hot former Berea Braves before August 2013 merged with Bay Park was because when I started at Polaris in 11 12 I was failing the deli the class that you came to of, and, and of the following year for as a junior I was failing that one so April thir Friday April 13 2012 I moved to the ESL the one I eventually finished in but because my my mid season move that was, well, almost, it was technically late season, but it was almost the end of the school year. It was almost time for summer. Um, that was not that did not count as a full, a full year in the program. So when I started my first full year in August 2012, that meant August. Uh, no, I had to stay an additional year at 13, 14. It was pretty much worth it. So I I, I wasn't I wasn't in Mr. Trying to go ESL and playability skills that in 2012, 2013. And then the following year when I was back with you, I was there 13, 14. So it wasn't that was not how it was supposed to be for me, but Ended up working out as as as, 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 as working out all as like um working out like, uh, even though it wasn't it wasn't planned or expected but it worked out. But well, I have a lot of fond memories of you like um when um all the field trips we took um like remember um South Park Mall I believe it was in Ox uh, October 2010 when I I they don't have this in that game room anymore I went to the Wheel of Fortune machine I just wouldn't I just wouldn't get away from it. I believe it was Miss Gretick was the one standing there taking pictures, either Miss Gretick or Miss Collins standing there taking pictures of me, hugging on that thing. Because Wheel of Fortune was is one of my favorite game shows, and I was watching it all every night at the time. I've been not been watching it lately. I've been so busy. I've not been watching Jeopardy a lot lately either. I've been busy with this YouTube thing, my my new job and everything. And 
the Spurs season on Fox Sports Southwest. And I just ended NASCAR season, so it's been a, it's been a busy go for me. And uh, that's why I've not been able to watch of Fortune or Jeopardy and Jeopardy or be outside and walk around and see my neighbors. But I don't know if you ever went swimming with me, but I rem remember the Akron. I don't know if you went to this, but remember the Akron Arrows game in the spring of 2011 when I got that whole when I got that whole se section next to us going. Julie Boozer, Boozer, Jesse Lewis, and the, um, we're, we're with, that was when they were those two were helping helping my my class the autism unit with oh, what what what. Hold on. Oh, you know what? That's kind of funny. I'm I'm recording this for you, and the Facebook notification is from you. I'm definitely sharing this with you on face on uh, Facebook. I can't believe it. Hold on. What did you say? What did you say? Oh, you you I you said please. You said please don't. It's it's oh, it's better if you don't get sick. Okay, and you were like okay. That's kind of funny how I'm recording this for you, and yet, um, you, you comment on my San Antonio, now you're, you're liking on my San Antonio post. Thank you, Chris, I love you, I, I, I got this for you just for, just, just for, uh, 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 I got this for you, just because you were in two of my notifications, I was recording this for you. This is for you. That's for you. Just, for, just for getting in my notifications as I was recording this for you. <laughs> Alright. I don't know about I don't know about you, but if you know Hannah Madsen from from our players days in 2013-14, I turned her into a Spurs fan. I I, helped, I we shared the Black Friday game against the Denver Nuggets on the road, even though she doesn't have Fox Sports Southwest like me. We shared it on on Facebook private message, and they won the game, and I helped her pick her favorite player, Patty Mills, where he's number eight. Um, I don't know about you, but maybe I maybe I can do the same for you. But except I, you can't pick my favorite player, which is Tim Duncan. You can't pick Hannah's favorite player, Patty Mills. We gotta pick somebody else for you if you if you if if you're okay with becoming a San Antonio Spurs fan. But um, I was describing memories of you, but not, I don't want to right now. I mean, I ha I named a couple good memories. I'll name one more, bro, before I sing the song. Um, and when um and um I when I remember one time when I, I was at Polaris um. Well, one I can't remember which day it was, but I was by, by your classroom, and uh, you came out, and I gave you, I wrapped my arm around you, and you you took my hand, um, put it up next to your cheek, and you used your other hand to pat it, and that made me happy. I really, I, I that was like, I think that was really in the morning, and I kind of, I think I, at the end of the day, I, when I was waiting, when we were waiting for our buses, I told you when you did it, did it that early that morning, it really, it really affected me. I think I remember that, but I'll just sing your song now. I can't wait for you to watch this video and hear see the Facebook notification uh, uh, go from you go off since because um since I was recording this for you. Where's the song? Hang on, let me do a test and make sure it's coming out of both spe speakers. Cause lately I've been having trouble with my speakers. Whenever I use them, let me see here. Oh, we should be good. We should be good. I don't want it too loud. I have sleeping people in my house. My dad, my dad went out with his friend. My grandparents are sleeping. My mom watching TV upstairs, and my sister ain't home. So I'm the only one who's active, doing something active. All right. So here, wait, wait. Make it a little louder, but not too loud. Okay, you can, we're ready, Krista. Here we go. Here we go. Happy twentieth birthday to you, Krista. But now you have an awesome birthday, and your wish is done. It's so great to stay in touch on Facebook since you made yours and friended me. Oh, we all was so much fun. In late 2010, in my sophomore season, where the autism unit and in my unit, when our classes took the old trips together. Christmas shopping, support the Akron Arrows game, and the Meadowbury Red to swim. The speaker wasn't working at first, but I got it now. The next two years we went to back to the Meadowbury Red for the Christmas dances, in which I went crazy to Ricky Martin, and you cheered for me like crazy. Graduated from Borea, and you started a 
Yeah, after I graduated from Rare, I thought I was never going to see you again. Look what happened. You were still going to Polaris, and and I came, I came back for my last full year in Mr. Charney's property or nine. You were giving me more hugs than you, than you used to, and vice versa. And I started hugging you more. So there you go. That's your birthday song for this year, Krista. I hope you liked it. So without further ado, because my camera doesn't have long-lasting battery. I don't. It's not a camcorder. It's just an actual the standard camera. If I had a camcorder, it could last a lot better, it could last longer, but I'm just going to get to your birthday game without a further ado. Okay, Krista, here we go. Let me fix the camera. Wait. There we go. I already picked the track Inferno Island on that. Next, the second race will be the last race will be Clockwork Wampa. Since you're a girl, and, and um, I'm going to pick a female character first, Coco Bandicoot. Alright. Normally I don't race as female characters because I'm I'm a I'm a I'm a guy, I'm a male, but this is I'm not playing for myself, I'm playing for you. So um this will be <laughs> I set it to five laps. And the next race I'll do in case my camera in case my camera's already get uh, has as as it runs out a little bit of battery, I'll do three laps the next race will be the second and final one. Yeah, and also I will sh I will tag when I post this to your Facebook wall, I will sh I will tag Hannah Madsen in this too. Also, I sent you a, I sent you a friend suggestion for you, so you can be Facebook friends. Since you guys were in the same class at players, like Green Flags out, we're racing and Inferno Island. Oh, you're off to a great start, but so I think they laid back, trying to get a run on you. How do you launch this shit? Cir circle. Oh, two for the price of one. Two car wreck. Coco's like coming through. It's crunch. Hey, sorry. Hey, sorry, big brother. But bam! Some wampa fruit came out of him, but I gotta see you. Shit, I I'm not used to this game. Like I'm crash, seat crash team racing, Krista. So um, I'm not quite sure if what the pop, so, some of the pops I don't know what they do. Whoa, 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 whoa! I gotta figure, I gotta know where I'm going to. Oh, this is a three lap race. Okay, I put it to three laps. I I thought I put this to five laps, but no. Might as well do both races, three laps. Someone must have walked in the door upstairs. TNT box. I know what that does. I've seen it in Crash Team Racing. Thrash boost. Dylan. Yep, that's Austin Dylan's woman on the Spurs. It's Ray McCollum. That might be your new favorite team, basketball team after tonight, Chris. Uh, Can you launch that backwards? Oh, this is a beat down. Holy shit. White flag one left to go. But as I was saying before this race started, um, I will share this when I when I share this to your Facebook wall, I will take Hannah Madsen and also be sure to friend her too. Cause if I if I remember correctly, you guys were in the same Polaris class and and our final and when we graduated Polaris in 13, 14. You and you and her were in Delhi and food and I was in the ESL. I was across the hall from you two. <laughs> Looks like I'll have two former um um um, um, sister, um, uh, two, two more, um, friends who are in the, who are in the, uh, complete, uh, opposite affiliate class with me who are going to be Spurs fans. I know Hannah's, Hannah likes Patty Mills, but I guess kind of, um, I'm thinking of a fair player for you right now, Crystal. When I do, when I do, when I do this close and, uh, the last part of this video, I'll, I'll just, I'll tell, I'll tell you the player I picked for you. Looks like you won this race. That was a beatdown. That was like a... I didn't get like a three or four second lead over whoever the hell the second place car was. I don't even know who that was. Should I want to quit? Hell yeah. Alright, I'll see you for the last race. Alright, Chris, the final race. I picked Clockwork Wampa. And yeah, I, I kind of did vice versa. I was going to do five laps the first race and three laps this this upcoming race. But I actually used the five laps to make it more exciting. Hey, if we, if we, if we have... I don't know if you'd be okay with this, but if it's another beatdown, I want to make sure I want to make it exciting. If we if we have a too much of a big lead, if we are putting too big of a beatdown, we'll turn around and go backwards, which is which I always like. Call we're gonna wait for the opponents until they catch up, and then we'll turn around and go back the right direction. All right, so I pick Crunch Bandicoot because every other character, some of the other good guys and bad guys are locked. You have to win some like adventure races to unlock them for these game modes. So Crunch Bandicoot it is. Let's go. Let's race. Last race. Bring home the championship, Miss Krista Buckner. You can do it. Oh. 
No bandicoots and bad guys, start your engines. Oh shit, this is the scariest fuck. Pole position, Chris, but there you go. This ain't data boost like Crash Team Racing. Oh my I think you spun the tires that time. There was no laying back from the Ah oh, crap in the turn one wall. Come on, Chris, let's get this shit together. Oh tornado! This ought to help. Yeah, this is not I can tell this is gonna be this is gonna be a very difficult I shouldn't have picked this track. This is a long ass track. I don't and it's five laps. I don't know how long my camera's battery can last for this shit. Aku Aku, here we go. Get the hell out of her get the hell out of her way. Forget about crunch. This is fucking Chris the Buckner driving this, car, this damn car. Shit, no 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 no. Okay, good, the wall saved you. I thought we were gonna fall off. Oh say oh sideways, sideways. Oh my god, Crunch can't turn this damn car. Shit, I had to spin the car car around to avoid falling off the edge. Oh my god. Look at this. Come at, you're, Crunch, she ain't coming at nothing, Crunch. Shut up. What does she what does she what is Krista coming at? We're coming at nothing because we keep hitting we keep smacking the wall. Just like Kyle, that's like the over 42 rated big phenom. They also, also called Big Phenom in the NASCAR Sprint Cup competition, Kylie Larsox. Yeah. He ain't gonna accomplish shit next year or Chad Johnson atop that pit box of 42 team. Hell no. If he didn't do shit for Smokey, he ain't gonna do shit for Larsox. Yeah. Yeah. When Kylie Larsox's NASCAR career fails, he'll be working in a, chi in a Chinese restaurant. Well, Austin Dillon and will be having the s same success in NASCAR as the San Antonio Spurs have in basketball. Yeah, Austin will have the success of the San Antonio Spurs, while Larsox will be working in a Japanese ja Chinese restaurant when his NASCAR career fails. That's just not just for next year, but also in the year years to come. Oh God damn it! This is a difficult track. I'm so glad these walls are there, otherwise we'd be falling, falling off so much. No! Oh my God! I didn't, I didn't know the what the floor opens up there. It had a door in it. The floor had a door. No. Oh my God! I didn't know the floor had a door in it, and we just fell off again. This, this remind, this looks like, a, this looks like a, um, this looks like a Roman version of Sonoma Raceway. Formerly known as Infineon Raceway and formerly known as before that Sears Point Raceway. What are you talking about what, Crunch? We're not accomplishing anything here. All we keep doing is crashing. Yeah, not just like Kyle Larson, but also like what Brian Scott and Stephen Wallace used to do in the, it was in the Nationwide Series in 2011. Crash every week. Yeah, yeah, Chris, you can hear I'm starting to bring I'm starting to bring some NASCAR references in this video. Since I am playing a racing video game, even though it's Crash Bandicoot, not NASCAR. <laughs> Fuck, I shouldn't have done that. We're not gonna win, Chris, though. There's no way we're gonna win this. Top five nope, I thought we were in the top five, but nope. Oh, we can kiss the top five goodbye. Oh my god, this race has not gone so well at all. Coming, you're coming at nothing, Crunch. I, I know we're playing for Krista. I know we're the ones who are supposed to avoid coming at... Shit. I try to avoid it as best as possible, but no success. Now we're... Oh my god. This is bad. This is really, really bad. This is absolute shit. I didn't hit on my neck. Oh, uh, it caused me to wreck. Oh my god. I never should have picked this track. I did. I. I, I don't think the tornado is gonna help me, help us. Shit! Hit the brakes. I gotta spin the car around. Oh my god, Chris! If we keep running like this, we're going to get lapped. There's, and not, and not like NASCAR, there's no caution flags to save us, or lucky dogs, or wave arounds, or back in the old day, we we can't race the, race the leader back to a caution to get a lap back. This is Crash Bandicoot, not NASCAR. Oh my god, this is bad. 
I'm going this way. Fuck it. And how did that work out? Fuck. This is bad. I'm never racing on this track ever again. Shit. Oh, come on, come on. Yeah, this has been an absolute trash race. Oh my god. So many dead stops. Is there any shortcuts we can, we can use to get back in this? I don't know if that's gonna help. Reboot shit. Oh, the start finish lines right there. Oh, they're already on the white flag lap. Yeah, we're, kind of, we're technically a lap and a half down. Oh, I just went backwards the bomb. I th I, this race is over, Krista. There's no way. It's over. Yeah, this race is over, Krista. This is just absolute trash. This race is over. Oh, just backed into the fence. Okay, yeah, let's see if going this way will work out for us this time. Literally, like Entrance is going to win this race. Either Entrance or Polar. How much battery do I have left? I still got a full battery. Oh, where are we going? Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Can I, will it run? Can I get it going? We're going to get laps. I was not going the right direction. All we're trying to do is ride around and finish this damn race. Yeah, it's over. Oh my god! I was trying to, Aku Aku. Come on, this is just a little piece of shit performance where uh, Crystal Buckner and I are having here. Oogaga, Aku Aku. What the fuck? How did that? Uh, uh, bullshit! How do you? How do you get stuck from that? How do you? How do you get spawn like that? Spawn? How do you? How do you get spawn like that? Okay, Grim Strands won this race. But how do you? How do you spawn from hitting that? That's crazy. Crash Bandicoot wasn't even in this race. The main character. I'm sorry, Chris, for that I had to see that performance in the second race, but. Oh well, shit, shit happens. You can't win a mall, but this, you can't. You, you're always gonna have a bad race, even in a video game, not just in NASCAR, but in a video game too. And even on the cooldown lap, yeah, you're, you're having a, having, it, it's going wrong. Everything's going wrong. Oh well, but I hope you enjoyed this video. No, that was just shit. So there you have it, Krista. That's your 21st birthday special for this year. Man, that that second race sucked big time. That sucked. That sucked big time. I never should have picked that trick. If I knew that track was going to be as long as shit, I never would have picked it. And I never would have picked Crunch, Crunch Bandicoot if I knew he was going to have a shitty, ill-handling car. But, yeah, we kept crashing. We kept backing in the fence. We kept spinning around backwards. We kept falling to the ground. Where that, there was a door in the wall, two parts of the track. Or door, I mean door in the wall. Door in the floor, excuse me. Um, we kept falling off the edge. That was not a good race. But I at least that first one was a beat down. I like that first one better. It was a beat down. Yeah. <laughs> oh well, that's what can you do? But and I, that's um before, besides that besides like, the game, um I'm I think I'm trying to think because the Spurs played tonight and I got your uh, old Delhi classmate Hannah Manson to become a fan. She I picked her I helped her pick her pick her favorite player, Patty Mills, who wears number eight. Um I think I might have found a play for a player for you. Um, let me think here. Um, yeah, I found him. I found him, and he—he—he's he, he, one of the next big things for. He's—he's he's turning into an emerging superstar this year in the NBA and for the Spurs in, in, alone. He leads the league in three point sh shooting as of now. Um, He—he's—he's he's one of the best players to never make an All Star team. Um, be playing this well. He was the defensive player of the year last year in the NBA and the year before when we when when they won the fifth championship the same year season we graduated Polaris. He won finals MVP. He won finals MVP. And he was a and he I think he finished third in rookie of the year standings in eleven twelve in the twelve 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 season. So um
Now, this is who your favorite player is going to be. This is just my help. If I'm forcing you, I'm I'm, I'm sorry. Because that's why I felt like I was doing to Hannah, but I, she said I wasn't. Uh, this is that's why this is what I picked for you. Kawhi Leonard, the claw number. Two. He wears jersey number two and has the has the has the corn rose. Yeah. Um. This is his because uh, first it was David. Uh, first it was George Gervin's team, the Iceman number forty four from the San Antonio Spurs from from the seventies, I believe. Then it was David Robinson's team, the Admiral number fifty. He doesn't play anymore. I, I grew up watching him, but he doesn't play no more. He retired in two thousand three and when I was a champion. And then it was this guy's team. Hold on, let me show you. Sam Duncan, that's my favorite player. He's been my favorite player for 19 years in a row. It's how long he's been in the league and how long I've been a fan. Then it was his team from 1997 until 2007, I believe. Then it was Tony Parker's team. I don't know if it was ever Ginobili's team, because he's always been a sixth man. Uh, he's always been coming off the bench as a sixth man. Now that it, there's not, now I went from Tony, I mean, it's Kawhi Leonard's team. That's your, that's your, your favorite player, your new favorite player as of tonight. First, it was, first it was Dice Man, then it was the Admiral, then it was, my, then it was my favorite player, the big fundamental Tim Duncan. Then it was TP9. Now it's the pass, it's, it's the passing of towards That's Kawhi Leonard's team, and also the Marcus Aldridge. I got my, it, that's my girlfriend's favorite player, favorite player, and because I got her to become a fan of the team, um, a, 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 a day or two ago. And actually, on Tuesday, um, I got I talked to her about it, and um, was it Tuesday? No, Thursday, I talked to her about it. The, the same night, the Spurs played the Grizzlies at on the road, and she, uh, when I came back, when I came back to work, the, the, the yeah, Friday was technically uh, technically yesterday, I believe. Um, she told, I asked her to rush the game. She said, "Yeah," and I told, and I'm glad she did because her favorite player, Lamarcus, Lamarcus Aldridge, was off to a bad start, and then he turned around the second half, and guess what? They won. Just like how they won Hannah's first game, experiencing the Spurs, even though she didn't watch it on TV. So now when it goes, Hannah and I have been in, in, in talks of her coming over here to North Ridgeville to see me. So our the Spurs game on Fox Sports Southwest. If there's ever a day that she ever that she does, if, if we're able to do, if her and I do that, you're invited too. That way the three of us can cheer on Tim Duncan, Kawhi Leonard, and Patty Mills together. I cheer on Duncan, Hannah cheers on Mills, and you cheer on Leonard. So... When I um when I post this to your Facebook wall, link to this video, um um I'll tag Hannah in it, and then I'll put the I'll put some of the San Antonio pages um on that I uh, that I I know you can follow in the com in, in the comments of the post. That way Hannah can Hannah can like them, Hannah can like them, and um and so can you um you um and also I'm gonna put Patty Mills and Kawhi Leonard's fan pages in there too, so you both can like them. Krista, yours yours is to like yours to like as Leonard's and um Hannah's is to uh it's like as Mills. Um and I'll put the Spurs official fan page in there. With though you know with the blue with the, with the blue with the blue circle with the white check mark, that means verified. And I'll and I'll put my own page that my own Spurs page that I run for all of that fan just a, a San Antonio fan page. It's not run by the Spurs, it's run by me and a few other Spurs fans around the country. It's called Fans of the San Antonio Spurs. I'll put that in there too. I'll put that in too so the, the two of you can follow it. So yeah, um so um so I'll tell you what, Krista. Um one more thing before I go. They play again Monday night against the Sixers in Philadelphia. If if you want, we can do what you and you we can you can do with me what we Hannah and I did on Black Friday during the Denver game. We can even though you don't have Fox Sports Southwest, so we can we can share the games together or private messaging. I can I can tell you everything that ha happened. And hopefully they'll win in your first game experience just like Hannah. So that you, you two can have the experience of uh, experiencing your first game despite not watching on TV and they win. And so hopefully uh, when the two of you come over here to Ridgeville to see me, um, so we can watch it, watch the game together on Fox Sports Southwest. Um, hopefully your first game, your, both of you have your first game watch, they win. And hopefully Leonard and, and Mills will do great. My favorite player, Duncan, will too. So that's all I'm going to say for now. Happy 21st birthday, Krista. I hope you had a great day today. I know you just came true. And once again, I'll see you on Never Sometime this season for a Spurs game on Fox Sports Southwest. As long as, uh, uh, and when I, when, when, when I, when, 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 well, let me try that again. I'll see you sometime during, a point, one point during this season when you come over here to Ridgeville to see me. Um, when, 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 um, when I invite Hannah Madsen over to, to invite, to, for a game. And, and also you can bring, you, she, she can bring you along for the ride. And I'll message you my number on Facebook, so that way you can that way you can have my n number, and that way you can text me whenever there's a good day you can come, and also you can try to get a hold of Hannah and see if she can come too. Happy 21st birthday, Krista! I love you. Go Spurs, go!